everyone in here, I imagine, has something that they really love and cherish. It uh, could be phone, family, food, friends, whatever. And now, Mom, uh, just imagine if that one thing you love a lot was taken away from you forever, or possibly in risk of being taken away from you, from you forever. Um, does that make you care about it more? Um, personally, I know it makes me think about it and care about it a lot more. And uh, it's kind of the same thing as like absence makes the heart grow fonder, kind of. Um, so, yeah. And how this really ties in with my speech is um, two uh, family members, or not family members, just people really close to me have gotten breast cancer. And um, it's just kind of really tough knowing that they could be uh, lost out of your life forever, which is really scary. Um, first person was my grandma. Um, she was diagnosed with breast cancer before I was born, so I guess kind of makes it a little bit easier, but just knowing that she um, uh, could possibly not be here right now just to help me out and stuff, that's, that's really tough. Um, she supports breast cancer. She goes to all the uh, breast cancer awareness, like football games, basketball games, stuff like that. She's a yes, she's a survivor now, but yes, there's always a chance that she could be diagnosed again. So that's kind of scary too. Um, the other person is uh, Darlene Strew. Um, she's a lunch lady here. She. Uh, she was diagnosed, I think it was a little less than a year ago. And um, uh, she has a grandson, Nate Struve. Yeah, a lot of you guys probably know him. Um, he was on my baseball team, still is, as we started back in like second grade. And she was always at every game supporting us, just being there cheering for us. After the game, picking us up if we lost, stuff like that. And I'm uh, I guess it was just really hard for the whole team when she was diagnosed. And um, yeah, we just kind of really tried to help the family out. Went over a lot after practice, did some chores, just helped them out with that stuff. And um, uh, she, over the summer, I think it was, she went and got uh, chemo for it. And uh, she's getting better a lot. And it was just nice towards the end of the season, having her be there at every game again, just supporting the team, stuff like that. And um, yeah, I guess just the lesson about that is it was really hard knowing that either one of them could have been, I guess, lost from breast cancer and just not in my life anymore. Thank you. All right.